Hi beauties. All right, today, one of our final subscription boxes. Um, it actually is normally one of the first to show up and it showed up really late this month. Um, I think like Ipsy Plus, Boxy Lux, FabFitFun, they all showed up before this guy did. This is of course my Glow Addict. Um, if you guys don't know what Glow Addict is, they are very indie, very small. This is the medium sized box. They have a small bag and then they have a skincare box. And I signed up for a year subscription about seven months ago. Um, and I've been pretty satisfied with it. I think they charge $18.99 plus shipping for each box. That sounds right. I don't, I don't remember. But they are not customized. Everybody's gonna get the same box depending on what level you have. And um, with that being said, I pretty much always know what's coming in the box because I follow them on Instagram. And I see when they post about like, hey, this is what the month is gonna entail. So I'm actually pretty jazzed about this one. They are giving us a palette that is from the same brand as the palette they gave us last month. And I really liked last month's palette. I did a look with it and I was very happy with how it turned out. It was really gorgeous. So like, let me stop talking. Let's just jump into this bad boy. So the first thing we have is from, it's I think it's C'est La Vie cosmetics it's a hybrid hydrogel rejuvenating collagen eye patch and we got a three pack of those um nice i don't really do eye patches that regularly but that being said i do like to have a couple ready to go when i like want to do a deep skincare uh routine and these sound like they're pretty right up the alley of what I would be looking for. They're supposed to reduce dark circles and enrich uh, with the blend of vitamin A and E to brighten the skin around your eye area. So I, I personally have really heavy dark circles. Um, they look really prominent right now because I've got red eyeshadow in them. Um, but no, like when I don't have makeup on, like I do have kind of like naturally like deep set darkened eye circle or eye bags under my eyes. So I do uh, like the idea like of using these to try and combat that. So yeah, cool, nice little product. Not necessarily something that I would like go out of my way to buy, but definitely something that I feel like I'll get used out of. Next thing I'm actually really excited about, I think these are super adorable. They are nice little mini like under eye beauty blenders. One of mine actually has like a little mark in it, but it's fine, I don't care that much. But they are red and green for Christmas and the red one has a Christmas tree and the green one has a candy cane. So I don't think you guys can see them because I don't think our camera is that great of quality. Um, but yeah, they're adorable. They're really cute. I always feel like I need beauty sponges, so I'm very happy with those. Um, I know they're tiny and I don't typically use, I probably won't, if I'm being honest, probably won't use them for under my eyes. I will probably use them to put on eyeshadow primer um, because I like having little ones to be able to go in there and like blend it out. Um, I don't know why, that's just always been my thing. I don't like applying it with a brush and so moving right along. Next thing we have is a glossy lamination liquid lipstick from Suva Beauty. And I know Suva is a brand that we have seen in Ipsy quite a bit. Um, I think I've gotten a couple eyeshadows from them. Um, I think my mom has as well. I don't think I've tried anything lipstick from them. Oh, pretty. Like a nice kind of berry shade. I'm gonna go ahead and swatch it and I'm gonna swatch it like, we just did another unboxing and I got like the remnants where I wiped it off. So I'm gonna do it like under that, but really pretty, nice, thick. I would call this like, it definitely, I don't think it's gonna dry down to be matte, but it definitely is like just kind of one of those like slightly reflective lipsticks, very, very pretty shade though. I feel like a lot, like the red that I'm wearing is kind of like that holiday red that people think about. And I think a lot of like, especially beauty boxes send you that kind of color during the holiday season. Um, so it's kind of nice to see like a dirt, like a big variation of that. Like this is definitely more of a berry shade, but I still think it would give you like that Christmas vibe. So cool, I like that a lot. All right, next thing we have is a really nice uh, brush that I don't know the brand. Um, so that worries me because I'm brushes I'm very particular about, but it, it looks like a really nice set, comes with a case and everything. And this is Kala Professional Makeup Tools. And you get two face brushes and it looks like one, two, three, four, five eyeshadow brushes. And yeah, nice little silver case. Yeah, it's a little magnetic case. You just pop it open and it's got spots for all your brushes. I think it's pretty cute. Brushes are hard. I always am excited to get them, but unless I know the brand, I'm, I'm kind of hesitant because I'm very particular about the, like using them. So well, that's definitely something I think we'll have to test out and see like how great of quality it is, but it, I'm excited to get it. It looks like a really nice set and I'm definitely excited to play around with it. The final thing, I'm very excited about this one. This is um, the Cookies Hemp Infused Palette from Millennial Beauté. We got like their bake sale or something like that or their pie one last month. Loved it, really just absolutely was thrilled with how it turned out when we sat and played around with it. And this one is a very different um, color combination. 
and still super adorable. I've been very fond of CBD hemp infused products this year. Um, skincare, eyeshadows, it barely doesn't matter. I've used like Pure's collection. I've used a couple other brands. I definitely have a couple face oils that have CBD in it. I, like, I really have enjoyed like the whole like hemp infused makeup craze. Um, and, and I'm excited to test this one out. I think there's a lot we can do with it. You've got like really pretty greens and you got like a pretty blue over here, purple, red, just a lot of very like holiday centric colors that you can work with in this palette plus some neutrals so yeah i was excited when i saw this this box when i saw the reveal for it i was like this is going to be a good way to finish off the year i'm excited about it i'm excited to receive it uh so i definitely i definitely told nikki i was getting a little worried what it was like you know December 16th and it still hadn't shown up yet. And I was like, it's normally here like the second. So I don't know where it is. Um, but yeah, I'm excited about this. Excited to play around with it and definitely want to test the palette out for you. So I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. It helps us out a ton. If you haven't subscribed, do that. It'd be a nice way to give us a Christmas present because we would love for you to be part of the Dark Angel family. Pretty cool. Okay, other than that, I hope you guys are all safe and healthy. You have a wonderful day and you stay girly with the darkest.